Hey, welcome back to Roscoe Reviews. I'm about to go on vacation with some friends of mine and due to all the craziness of travel and everything, I'm going to have to pack only in a carry-on suitcase. So a buddy of mine that travels all the time suggested that I get some packing cubes, specifically ones that compress your clothing into a smaller space because I need to fit a week's worth of stuff plus my uh, drone and tripod and video equipment into one carry-on. So I went on Amazon and I purchased some Bagel packing cubes. I got a pack of four. There are several brands on there and they all appear to be about the same. It just depends on if you want four or eight or seven. So I got a pack of four and I will link these down below. At the time that I was looking in the compression cubes, these were the cheapest ones that I could find. The pack of four from Bagel. So I'm going to try to pack all of my clothes to this. And I have seven t-shirts, a long sleeve shirt, a jacket, a pair of jeans, a pair of pants, a pair of shorts, swim trunks, seven pairs of underwear, seven pairs of socks, an extra pair of shoes, my drone, a small tripod, and my bag of toiletries. And I have to get that all in one suitcase. So let's give it a try. The bags come with four sizes. They operate pretty easily. You unzip both zippers. So this is the one where you put the stuff inside and then there is a second zipper that expands the bag out. And it zips all the way around so that it expands the bag to uh, three or four inches deep. And you put all your clothes in there. So I'm gonna start with the bulky stuff like my jacket. I'm going to try to leave everything folded so that it's not getting all wrinkled and put all of the shirts in there. Take the second largest one and I'm going to put my pants in this one. This is the first time I've tried to do this. I have not uh, ever done these before. I did not plan this at all. I am just going on a whim here. Going to give it a try. This one trunks in too. Okay, I'm going to zip one of these up and see how well it works. Uh, I've got a pair of jeans, pair of pants, pair of shorts, and my swim trunks in here. First, you zip the the opening close so that they're in there and then you're going to zip that other zipper all the way around and it will compress the bag down to a smaller size. It's kind of similar to using the vacuum bags but you don't have to have a vacuum to do it, it's doing it with a zipper. Maybe a trick would be to sit on it, squish the air out. Pack them pretty small. Do the same with my shirts. This bag might have been a little bit big for my shirts, but that's okay. So keep all your clothes nice and organized too. Then in the next size down, I'm gonna do my undergarments. I'm tempted to put my shoes in there too, but I don't want to get my clothes all dirty. That'll be nice too, that'll keep your clothes clean and separated from your other stuff. Okay, I've packed all my cubes. I don't know, I'm still a little bit skeptical. It's going to take up a lot of space. I got a lot of stuff to get in here. The bag that I'm using is, I bought the set of three Amazon Basics bags. I have used these for several years. They've been across the pond multiple times. Uh, I've never had one break. All the wheels still work well. And they're like very durable, the hard shell. 
And of course I went with the orange because most people go with black and then when you're waiting for your bags and baggage claim, everybody has black ones or gray ones. So I like the orange. I'll put a link for the Amazon Basics uh, luggage down below as well if you want to check that out. I really do like those and they're pretty inexpensive. Okay, I'm going to try to get my drone, and my toiletries, and my shoes on one side. And a week's worth of clothes on the other side. Uh, and my tripod. Yeah, wait on that. Okay, I'll put the big one in. Uh, the large bag seems to be the size of a carry-on. Small one. Maybe I should have gone with the small one for that. It could have fit in there. Switch that up. Looks like you get the most benefit out of these if you're really trying to pack them full and then zip them down because this one might actually save some space. Okay. I got all my clothes on one side, I've got my drone, my shoes on the other side. The only thing I'm lacking is my tripod. I think I can maybe get it in over here. Right here along the edge. If you need a handy little tripod, I've got a video for this too. I'll put a link right up here. Nice little plug. This thing is fantastic. Yep. Now will it shut? I didn't use the second to the largest size, or second to the smallest size, I guess. There you go. Weeks worth of clothes and my video gear, uh, all in one carry-on bag. It's a little heavy, but it probably won't weigh it, so that's okay. Uh, as for the bag L packing cubes, uh, what I like the most about it is the organization. When I go to open this back up, I will have all the individual bags that I can hang, uh, that I can hang them up, and I'll keep my stuff folded even while they're hanging up, because they'll be all zipped in there. Again, I'll put a link for these bag L pack packing cubes, the compression cubes, down below in the description. I paid $26 for them. They were one of the cheapest ones that were on there at the time when I was shopping around. They are. Uh, seemingly really good quality. The zippers all worked really well. Uh, they're a nylon material. It seems like it's pretty durable. So I'm excited to take this on my trip for a week. That's how you pack an entire week's worth of clothes in your camera gear and your carry-on bag. Thanks for watching. We'll see you back here next time.